All right, here we are, Microsoft Flight Sim, playing on an Oculus Quest 2 through virtual reality desktop. We're gonna go through one of the first training missions here, which is basic controls and camera. Let's fly. We've got a Thrustmaster T16000M HOTAS setup, so a throttle and a stick to use. And it's just gonna give us a feel for how the game functions in VR and uh, how the controls function without being able to uh, see them because we've well, got a headset on. I did have to uh, unbind, I believe, uh, elevators from the joystick because I hit a button and all uh, the plane started pitching up violently um, even when the stick was centered. So here we can look around. We haven't started yet. We uh, pull the trigger to start flying, I think. There we go. Welcome to flight training. I'm your instructor, off. Captain Molina, but you can just call me Jess. This okay, session, Jess. we'll get started with some basic controls. Sound good? Sounds great. First things first, let's get familiar with your surroundings. Now that we're oriented, it's your turn. Time to fly this bird. The first right. control on our training cool. list is the yoke. I still remember my first instructor saying the yoke is like a steering wheel. Almost. Sure, Almost. you can turn, but you can also pitch. For starters, it controls the ailerons. And the ailerons, they allow the plane to roll and bank into turns. Go ahead and try rolling to the right. Well, that was the left. Nice. Okay. <laughs> now let's see you level back out. Hey. I'm kind of drifting up, but I think that's probably in intentional. I don't think that's any adjustment we Good. made. Maybe that's airflow or something. Of course, the yoke also controls the I don't know very much about flying. And the elevator affects the plane's pitch, right? Pull back on the stick, the plane starts to climb. Give it a shot. The most valuable things in aviation are speed and altitude. But notice when you're pitching up, yeah, your speed is important. decreasing. You could add more power. Or for now, let's just pitch down. Just like that, your speed's picking up again as the nose pitches down. As you level back out, let's talk about another control, the rudders at your feet. They're not at my feet, Rudder but let's talk about them. control the aircraft's side-to-side -side movement, also known as yaw. On the ground, those pedals are going to steer the plane left or right. Up here, they properly align us during turns. Try them out, and watch the plane's nose skew to either side. So, the Thrustmaster stick has uh, the ability to Simple twist, enough, right? so that's what Before we use we instead on, of pedals let's here. let's bring the plane back to straight up light. Make sure your dashboard is aligned three to four inches below the horizon for a cruise attitude. Three to four inches? You left the training airspace, you need to go back. Okay. How do I know what Before the training airspace is? Before we go on, is? let's bring the plane back to straight up flight. Make sure your dashboard is aligned. You've left the training airspace. You need to go back. Am I back in it yet? Before we go on, let's bring the plane back to straight up flight. Make sure your dashboard is aligned three to four inches below the horizon. You've left the training airspace. You need to go back. Okay, so... Before we go on, let's bring the plane back to straight up flight. Make sure your dashboard is aligned three to four inches below the horizon for a cruise attitude. Altitude too low. Okay, the last thing we're gonna cover now is the throttle. Okay. If you have Let's the need for speed, up. then the throttle's for you. Full control over the power output of the engine. Let's see what happens when you cut all the power. Hmm, do we wanna see what happens? Let's do it. Ooh, that doesn't sound good. Peaceful though. Surprise, surprise. 
Our altitude is decreasing. This might be a good time for a piloting PSA. Always keep an eye on your surroundings, because nobody likes a low-flying duck. You've left the training airspace, you need to go back. Really picky about this, this training airspace. This might be a space. good time for a piloting PSA. Yeah, let's Always throttle keep back. an eye <laughs> on your surroundings, because nobody likes a low-flying duck. All right, let's go ahead and throttle back up. Way ahead of you. There you go. Speed is increasing, and as long as we maintain the same attitude, our altitude will keep climbing too. You're really getting the hang of your controls. Before long, you won't even need a co-pilot. Until then, if you want help with the radio or checklists or simply flying the plane, I'll be here. You can pass me the controls when you're ready to finish your session, or keep flying. It is a great day after all. Well, there you have it. That ends the first training mission. It's on Oculus Quest 2 through Virtual Reality Desktop with the Thrustmaster HOTAS set up. Thanks for watching. Catch this video at youtube.com slash substatica. And uh, catch me live at twitch.tv slash substatica. Like, follow, subscribe. All that good stuff is appreciated if you enjoy the content. And certainly check out Microsoft Flight Sim uh, with VR support. Catch you next time.